Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Theo here. Today I'm going to show you how to install these Porsche key covers into my Porsche key. The reason I decided to purchase these key covers is because I have a blue Porsche and I wanted my key to match the color of my car. Now, I could just go ahead and swap, you know, a new key, but that's more expensive. So I decided to go on Amazon and purchase these key covers to replace that black piece right here with these chrome uh, blue ones. Although my car doesn't shine as chrome like this one. Now, to complete this job, what you're going to need, you're going to need a flathead screwdriver and a Phillips screwdriver, preferably small ones like these. Now, the first thing you want to do is to go ahead and flip your key and use the flathead to kind of remove that emergency key there you go just like that once you remove that out if you want to replace your battery at the same time just use your key put it in the hole here and you can prop it open just like that but in this case i'm not going to do that so i'm going to go ahead and put that back in there now use your phillips screw head to remove the screw that is right here just like that okay now that the screw is out you can place it down this will just remove this little clip that is holding the strap that I have here. Now, we can go ahead and remove that chrome silver piece right here using the flat head. So all we do is put it in the hole and pry it up. Just gentle. There you go, it's coming off. And that is out. Now that it is out, you also have this piece out right there. What you want to do next is continue to use the flat head and find this little notch here to remove the side pieces. Just little notch and I'm going to push that out. There you go. First part is out. Do the same thing on the other side. There you go. It is out. And that's it. Now this is literally everything that is left from your key right here. Now on other key model, this piece right here also come out but in mine it seems like it did not come out did it just break no it seems like it is stuck well actually it seems like it broke well it's fine i was replacing it anyway so i'm just gonna go ahead and kind of try to remove that there you go now what we want to do first is to put the side pieces so we put everything back in you know the same order so first we want to do put back the side pieces because remember, those are the ones that we removed last. So go ahead and put that. Bam. Put the other side, which is this one right here. Bam. There you go. Now we take the middle piece and we put it here. Remember this little notch goes in here. So you want to put the notch first. There you go, just like that. And put that. Bam. Gently, of course. And of course, it doesn't want to go in gently. Well, well, let me do that again. Maybe if it doesn't want, you can remove that other piece again first. This is in now. We can go back and place these again. Technically, it doesn't really matter when you place those, they fit right in. Other side went there. There you go, fits right in. Push it just like that. Ooh, starting to look nice on the top here. Now, remember to put back this the unlock always goes on top so you push that on top and just squeeze in and it goes in submission now it's starting to look like a key so what you want to do next is put back the little clip here put back in there and put the philip screwdriver put that philip screwdriver right here Bam. Now, 
final piece, put back the emergency key. And that's it. My key has been upgraded. It looks much, much, much better. It's actually slicker and it match my strap and it match the color of the car. I'm actually I need to push this further in just like that. There you go. How do you like it, guys? I think uh, I like the look. Thank you and uh, see you on the next video. Bye-bye.